Opening set. Opening set. I saw you up there. And I now you're you over there. the week. I saw you up there. Bar What's up, gang? We're here in the plane on the way to Regeneron ISEP 2023 this year in Dallas, Texas. Alan, are you having a good time? Yeah. Ikhanj, are you having a good time? Ishan. Welcome back to the Shark Tank vlog. Today we're going to be talking about ISF 2023, Houston, Texas. It's in, it's oh, in Dallas, Dallas. Texas. We're going to have a lot of fun in Richard Gates and win a lot of money, and I'm going to steal it. <laughs> All right, Alan, what do you think of the humidity here in the Dallas airport? It was like hydro about mid Uh, okay, I don't know about that, but what I do know is that it's so humid in the airport. Like, if we rub our hands together hard enough, I feel like it's gonna like synthesize water straight there. Everything has a connection. So we're in the hotel and there's basically a perfect spot for photos right here with the spotlight too. So the Lorenzo has got us set up pretty good. All right guys, we're here in the convention center officially getting registered for ISAC. And so as you can see behind me, there's the registration. And then over on this side, we have the career and colleges uh, center area where you can check out those opportunities. So I'm just waiting for registration over here. Uh, my hair is all wet because it was raining outside. Hey, we're here at the exhibit booth here at Regeneron ISEF 2023. And I have my poster working on it and we have some uh, people here who are joining me uh, and observing me set it up. So say hi. 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 All right. All right, y'all. So the people finally left. And so I'm here setting up my board. This is the biomedical engineering category, as you can see over there. And this is my board here, which I am in the process of setting up. Looks like there's going to be a lot of people here who recognize me. Are you, are you recording? Yeah, I got, I got. Are you seeing this yeah. pin exchange going on between Rishabh Jain and Rishabh Jain viewers? <laughs> Three Indiana pins right here. Woo! All right, so after spending an hour janking this display, let me show you guys how I do it because, I mean, I'm not competing next year, but I wish I would have recorded what I did last year because I forgot how I made it stand. Anyway, I like to have my poster like slanted like this instead of like folded like this. Um, and I don't even know how this person did this. They did some like thumbtacking thing to make it straight. But as you can see here, let me show this. I put the trash can and cardboard here to make it stay. Tell me when it starts. All right, so we're here at the ISAP fitting And so we're gonna do the Oregon, uh, Portland, Oregon road. Washington Apple, Washington Apple. Hey, so I'm reunited with two RSI 22 Alex, and so uh, for the camera, say where you guys are from. Uh, I'm Eric, I'm from New York. I'm Alex, I'm from New York. I'm Alex, I'm from New York. I'm me, and I'm from New York. Okay, so we're in the second half of the pin exchange, and this here is one of the Discord members. Hi. Say hi, where are you from? Utah. I'm from Utah. Utah, okay, and we have Alan over here. Uh, our product is about electric venues, so we designed a way to stop, uh, we designed electric venues in the last year. And this year we designed a way to stop certain elements of the thermoxidizing and high pressure. Now, so you see that right there. Rishabh Jain Colt members are doing the best projects at ISA, and that's a sign that you should join. Discord link is. Hi, what's up, guys? My name is Rishabh Jain, and I'm back here with another Minecraft YouTube video. We are from Thailand, and we are so. Your videos on YouTube, and it's really inspiring. Yeah, yeah, all right. You guys can see how big this entire place is. 
We have some Team Oregon people right here as well. Say hi. All right. Say bye. Okay. I'm from Israel and I'm from Cellular Biology. And how did you see the channel? Both um, because your uh, like videos are very relevant uh, for me. Okay, we're at the pin exchange here and I'm with this group of students. So tell the camera where you're from. No, I'm from Houston. I saw Rashad's channel browsing through LinkedIn. I'm also from Houston and I saw him because one of my friends sent him uh, sent his link to me. Alright. Oh, I'm from Indiana. I saw his winning. Yeah, I'm from Wisconsin. Uh, I'm from Wisconsin. And you know me. And I lost him last year. <laughs> <laughs> He's not winning this year. All right, we're here at the Pin Exchange, and these students are all from the same school. What school are you guys from? We are from Thomas Jefferson High School for Science and Technology in Virginia. Okay, um, and how'd you guys find the YouTube channel? Um, it was just Googling. Yeah. Uh, I, I wanted ISOP prep tips. So. Oh, yeah. Uh, subscribe right. to Rizal. You guys yeah. heard it here, right? Subscribe now. Yeah. I'm Rishav Jane's number one fan. Are you that YouTube guy? Yeah. The RSI? Can I take a, can I take a photo with you? <laughs> so I'm here at the pin exchange. It's winding down with Team Canada. So after a restful night, we're here starting day two of the Regeneron ISEF experience. We're gonna catch breakfast and then head over to the convention center to finish setting up our projects and getting everything checked off. So right outside the convention center, you can see the ISEF decorations and branding everywhere now. The opening ceremony of Regeneron ISEF 2023. Alright, so we're heading to the first day of stuff in the exhibit. We're going to be doing some sponsor and VIP presentations. 
Um, and there's might be some press who's gonna walk around and look at finalist projects. And so we're here walking in the giant line. I love the to go ahead. So we're on the way to dinner today. There hasn't been much going on because uh, judging is tomorrow. And so I think they wanna give people some time to rest. And so tomorrow's gonna be a lot more crammed, a lot more hectic, but we're just enjoying our time here. <laughs> Oh shoot, it's going to be copyrighted. Alright, today's the day we're here for judging at ISF. Um, it is Wednesday and we had to wake up relatively early for this one. But we're now heading over to the exhibit hall. There's already a line of like what seems to be a thousand people. And so, yeah. We have three hours of judging in the morning, a lunch break, and then three more hours. So I think it's something like six, seven hours or something in total. Um, and yeah, it's gonna be really fun. So I love you, Rashad. I love me too. We just finished the first judging session and are on the way to lunch. So we finished up with lunch and we're heading back for the second round of the judging. And so I think the second round I'll have four scheduled category judges and in the first round i had three so definitely a lot more judges this year than last year i think last year i had like three or four hey guys so we're here at the uh judging day here at regenera on isf and so this is the second session we're almost towards the end of it and i have a Bishop Jane channel viewer right here good friend, um, good who's competing at ISEF for the first yes, time. Sir, yes, sir. Said some really kind words and oh, yeah. I appreciate the message. Gotta keep it real, man. All right. This guy's working wonders. He's doing miracles for the people coming up. <laughs> Gotta make sure they're nice and prepared. Listen to his advice. You know, I know it sounds counterintuitive to what a lot of people are saying and what your intuition might say, but developing that flow and developing that skill, I mean, there's gonna be times in life, especially not having a script where people are gonna put you on your feet. They're gonna throw you in the pool in the deep end. You're not gonna know what to do. You gotta learn how to swim, right? Hey, but I'd say you're pretty good at talking without no script for this vlog. Thanks, man. All right. We'll learn see from you. the best, right? <laughs> Can I be in your vlog? It's not a vlog. All right, guys, the extensive day of judging is now over, and we have a gold medal winner pizza over here ordered by my boy Ikanj. He knows the good spots, and now we're gonna enjoy it over in the pool. So it's public day and I have a mob following me. I'm not part of that mob. I'm not part. I'm just walking. He was walking through the park and he was reciting some stanzas from a play. A rotating magnetic field appeared in the sunshine in his brain. So we're done with educational outreach day and public day. I gave a little speech for education outreach day talking about my experience. And in public day, I was just in front of my booth and a bunch of people kept coming by. And so now we're on the way to lunch. It's Thursday evening and we're heading to the special <laughs> award ceremony. Boy, Sean just won the CIA first yeah. place award. How are you feeling? Feeling really good. Excited. Emma All right. Markovic. Yeah, Emma! We're now walking over to the grand award ceremony. It's Saturday, the last day of ISA. And I'm so excited for these guys. I need beer. I got Please welcome once again your host, Barb Baker. that solution and be an inventor. All of you have shown that you have 
ability to contribute to scientific progress. $2,000. To help present these awards, we are honored to be joined by several very special guests from our category sponsors. We begin with the Animal Sciences category. In the category of Biomedical Engineering, the fourth place award winners are from Bentonville, Arkansas, Chandra Kiran Kushit Suda. From Waterloo, Canada, Cindy Chang. From the villages, Florida, Hannah Grace Kennedy. From Chicago, Illinois, Maya Joshi. From Aman Jordan, Rashid Kabir, Salem Aditi, and Ryan Dare. From Portland, Oregon, Rashad. From Vancouver, Canada, Tara Tianru Sam. From Pottstown, Pennsylvania, Zeshen Chen. So it's truly the end of an era. After seven years of science fair, we're here back at PDX Airport, finishing it off. The journey is over. What has it been, six years? Seven. Seven years. That is crazy. Me and Alan, I remember the sixth grade bus to the Whitford Middle School to compete in our first science fair. 